there, I'm Jamie, and welcome to the Pet Science Lab's informational Petitu video. Thank you, first and foremost, for buying a Petitu kit. And if you stick with me for a minute or two, I'm going to teach you how to use the Petitus. And this is our lovely model, Delilah. Now, Delilah has been talking to me all morning, telling me what kind of Petitu she wants. And now, she's finally going to have a voice of her own. Right, Deej? All right. Now, the first step in applying your Petitu is talking with your dog. You have to decide what kind of Petitu they want. Now, Delilah and I, like I said, have had a lengthy conversation this morning, and she's told me that she wants the Petitu Cat Suck. But there are a lot of other Petitus that you can choose from. And if you go to our website, www.petsciencelabs.com, you can see all the different Petitus that we have that are available for you. Or if you want something custom, like say you own a dog salon or a doggy boutique, or maybe you're even a veterinarian, we can customize a Petitu for you for your advertising needs. So, Delilah, are you ready to pick? Here we go. This is our Petitu, Cat Suck. And now, on to step two. Now we're on to step two. We've picked our Petitu, and now we need to pick our paint color. Each Petitu kit comes with a paint pot strip of six paint colors. Now, if you have a white dog, I would suggest using a paint color like black or blue. That's going to translate better on their fur. However, if you have a black dog, like a big, gorgeous black lab, I would suggest using a paint color like white or yellow. That's going to translate better on their fur. Since Delilah has this really cute little black spot here, I'm going to put her pet tattoo, Cat Suck, in white on her black spot. And now we're on to step number three, applying the paint to the pet -a Now we're on to step number three. We're going to apply the paint to the Petitu. Each Petitu kit comes with a paint applicator. So what you're going to do after you pick your color, like I said, I picked the color white, you're going to take your paint applicator, dab the applicator into the paint. Make sure that you don't have it too saturated. You just want a nice covering of paint over the sponge. And then you're going to take and neatly put the paint over the graphic on the Petitu. <laughs> there you go, it's really, really simple and a lot of fun. Ooh, careful, Delilah. Let's make sure we have enough on there. You don't want to get the paint too thick and you don't want to get the paint too thin. So it's just going to be kind of at your discretion how much paint you get on there. But you'll be able to tell. If the paint starts to glop in the inner parts of the letters, then you know you've got a little too much on there. Do you want to get enough on the graphic so that it will translate to the dog's coat and be nice and neat? And when you're applying the paint, pay special attention to each side of the letter and the bottoms of the letters so that you get a really sharp graphic of the Petitu on the dog's coat. All right, now we're ready to apply the Petitu. Each Petitu has a handle, so you're going to grab the handle, pick the spot on the dog that you want to apply the Petitu, and what I usually do is just take my hand over the fur Kind of get it all going in the same direction. All right, Delilah, are you ready to have a voice of your own? Okay. So here we go. I'm going to apply it. Now, this is a foam rubber stamp material, so it's pretty flexible. So if you need to, you can kind of bend it over the dog's body where you want the Petitu to go. I'm going to put this right here. Are you ready, Delilah? Ooh, careful, baby. And there you go, it's that easy. A perfect Petitu in under a minute. Look at that. That is so cute. Delilah, you've got a voice of your own. 
even though I don't think cats suck. And we have lots of sayings, so just look on our website. Again, the website address is www.petsciencelabs.com. Look on there, we've got tons of fun sayings for you to give your pet the voice they've always wanted and deserved. And like I said, there are customizations available. So if you're interested in any advertising needs for any events, any kind of charity events, any auctions, just let us know and we will be more than happy to put you in touch with our wholesale pricing department. And now, on to step five, Petitu removal. Just stick around and we'll show you how easy it is. Now it's time for step five, Petitu removal. <laughs> it's really simple. All you need is a paper towel and, I'm sorry Delilah, you're going to just get it a little bit damp with some water. Doesn't need to be hot, doesn't need to be cold, just room temperature is fine. You don't need to get it too wet. And just rub it off. Sorry Deej. It's really, really simple. And your Petitu should last a day or two. This is completely safe, fun, non-toxic paint. Very similar to a children's poster paint. And you can see how easy it comes off. So, potentially your dog could wear several Petitus a day. <laughs> Each Petitou kit comes with a paint pot strip with six individual paint colors. So, once you and your pet have picked their Petitou to give them the voice they've always wanted, and once you and your pet have picked the right color, you're going to take the paint applicator, which is also included in each kit, apply the paint, take the stamp, stamp it on the dog, and when you want to remove it, just get a damp paper towel and wipe it right off. It's that easy. After you've applied the Petitou, take a picture and email it to us or contact us. Give us a call at 941-870-3210. We want to post them up on our website and maybe, just maybe, have a contest for the best Petitou. So thank you so much for watching this video. I've had a blast. My name's Jamie. This is Delilah. And from all of us at Pet Science Labs, thanks a lot for buying your Petitou kit. We look forward to hearing from you in the future. Bye.